Our tale of the tape is brought to you by X-Men First Class. Bring home the first summer blockbuster of the year on Blu-ray and DVD today. You see here, everything pretty much the same. Chris Lozano, a slight reach advantage. He likes his hands, he likes that boxing. He's gonna have to use that slight advantage to keep this fight standing and keep Brent, Brent Weeman at fist range. With the official introductions, here again is Michael Williams. Elder Fighting Championships on MTV2 and on Epics in HD, along with Caesars Atlantic City Routinely Spectacular. Now present three five-minute rounds, the final fight of the welterweight tournament quarterfinal round. Brought to you by Drive, starring Ryan Gosling. MTV calls Drive the full package. Drive in theater September 16th. There are no clean getaways. And now, first introducing the red corner. At six foot one, weighing in at 170 and one half pounds. Near perfect as a professional. Eight victories, only one defeat from Cleveland, Ohio. Chris, the Cleveland Assassin Lozano. And across the cage, his opponent fighting out of the blue corner. At six foot, he weighed in at 170 pounds. His professional record stands at 19 and six with one draw. From Louisville, Kentucky, introducing Brent Wheatman. And the referee in charge of the action, Keith Peterson. Sir, sir. Both of you have been given your instructions. I'll take this up at all times. So my commands all times. Touch gloves. Let's fight, guys. One berth remains in the semifinal round. Douglas Lima, Luis Santos, and Ben Saunders are already through. The so winner of ready? this fourth so welterweight tournament quarterfinal fight. joins those three men in the last four. The bell in round number one. Tonight's fight clock is sponsored by Drive, starring wow. Ryan Gosling. Oh, they're already starting off fast. Good right hand by Weedman. That film in theater, September 16th. There are no clean getaways. Don't grab the cage. Uh, Weedman trying to come back. That almost a full body slam there, Jimmy. Yeah, he was clipped, came back, flattened Lozano, and put him against the fence. Chris Lozano is in the white trunks. Brent Weedman is in the gray trunks. Keith Peterson is the referee. And a frantic pace to start this fight. See, Weedman with one hook in. He says he has a serious advantage on the ground, and I agree. Lozano, a blue belt in jiu-jitsu. Weedman has outstanding submission skills to go with his Muay Thai. Weedman does hold the rank of brown belt in judo, but first and foremost, he says, I am a Dutch-style Muay Thai fighter in MMA. Dutch-style Muay Thai, they throw a lot more punches than they do in Thailand. Much better boxing, much better hands. They angle a little bit more. Grab the cage. Like Brent Weedman, Chris Lozano also fighting in Bellator's Oh, four. beautiful throw! Huge throw there. Season four, 170-pound tournament. Losing in the quarterfinal round in March of this year, a unanimous decision versus Lyman Good. Man, great back and forth. Lozano throwing the judo brown belt. Lozano now putting him against the fence. Lozano, Jimmy, telling us that he is so much more confident and so much more relaxed for this fight in this tournament than he was back in the spring. Both guys once again meeting in the center of the cage. These two fighters have a lot of respect and admiration for each other. Both saying this is going to be a tough and potentially very long fight. Knee from Weedman. Both also saying that they want to oh! finish early. Look Another at that. good throw. And when they stood back up, Lozano looked very tired. One hook in from Brent Weedman, trying to take the back. Weedman can't get the other hook in. So he's got the arm trapped, but is he deep enough for rear naked? I don't think so, can't really see from here. Weedman looking for the rear naked choke finish. Halfway through round number one. Loads of time for Weedman. Weedman still looking for that rear naked choke. Big right hand. With just one hook in, still has the back of Lozano. Lozano trying to explode to his feet. He's on one knee. 
Weedman still thinking rear naked choke. I remember 19 of his victories. He has 18 finishes. Seven submissions, 11 KOs. Brent Weedman gets an opening on you. He takes you out. He's working hard for that rear naked on Chris Lozano. Weedman now trying to flatten out Lozano. That's that body triangle locked in, those long legs. This has to be very fatiguing for Lozano, carrying all that weight on his back. Weedman putting so much pressure with the hips. Jimmy, I think you'd agree this is where the body triangle can be really devastating. It can be. It takes, you can't take a full breath. It takes so much out of you, especially against someone like Weedman who knows how to use it. We've been holding that tight body triangle. Has the back. Still thinking rear naked choke. Chris Lozano holding on. Final minute now of round number one. Again, the winner is the fourth and final semi-finalist in this season five Bellator welterweight tournament. The winner of this tournament claims a check for $100,000 in a world title shot. So much at stake in this bout and in this season five 170 pound tournament. And we is just glued to Lozano's back. All of the weight from that body triangle. You see Lozano trying to get up. One thing about the body triangle, it's hard to keep your opponent from moving. You're latched onto him, but it's not like having both hooks in where it's easy to flatten him out. Lozano, you see Lozano, you see Lozano not flat here. It's like a backpack. Lozano just waiting to hear the bell. Closing seconds of round number one. Left hands from behind by Weedman. The end of round one. This here a nice finish by Weedman. You see here, Weedman throwing that right hand, bang, right over the top, catches Lozano right on the nose, and then bang, that step over takedown, beautiful hip toss. Most of that fight, though, on the ground was from here. Weedman throwing Lozano and staying on top, using great positioning, great hips. So are you ready? Moving you into ready? round fight. number two of this fourth and final welterweight tournament quarterfinal, and Jimmy on your scorecard. 10-9, Brent Weedman. Most of that fight spent on top. Weedman in control. Also, knocking Lozano down with that beautiful right hand. Chris Lozano is in the white trunks. Brent Weedman is in the gray trunks. Jimmy, like you and me, Chris Lozano is a huge fan of the seminal 1980s Jean-Claude Van Damme film Bloodsport. <laughs> Round one looked like the Kumite in Bloodsport. Uh, it certainly did. Left hand from Weedman. And both guys throwing a lot of leather here. Oh, good shot by Lozano. Weedman now a knee to the stomach. Another good right. This is where Lozano's very effective at close range. I think he hurt Weedman with that right hand. Round number two of this fourth welterweight tournament quarterfinal, Chris Lozano versus Brent Weedman. The winner through to the semifinals where he will join Douglas Lima, Luis Santos, and Ben Saunders. With Jimmy Smith, I'm Sean Wheelock. We are cage side at Caesars in Atlantic City, New Jersey. Glad you are with us watching on MTV2. And for the first time on Epics in HD, Bellator 49 and the season five opener of Bellator Fighting Championship. Oh, good left hand by Lozano. Surprised we're not seeing more kicks from Weedman. Weedman is trading punches with a very heavy hitter. Both guys landing. I think Lozano is landing the heavier punches. Weedman back to his feet. Wide left hand, big knee then from Lozano. The left got through Weedman in all sorts of trouble as he steps back and fires back with the right. But he's still going forward. I think he's hurt, he's wobbly, but he's still going forward. I don't know if that's the best strategy with a puncher like Lozano. Weedman looked like he was in all sorts of trouble. He definitely wobbled, but then came right back forward. Two very tough fighters, two very, very hard punchers and hard kickers, just like that on cue. A little cut under Lozano's right eye. 
But I think he's having success in his Big right hand by Wheatley. Good one. Now Lozano takes a step back, appears to be in trouble. Both guys seem so winded. I mean, they're, they're keeping such a heavy pace. Back and forth we go. Short wow. clubbing left hand by Lozano. Good right, Big right hand. Weedman's hurt, but he is still on his feet. Man, these guys are delivering exactly what they promised. They said, we're going to stand toe-to-toe -to -toe and bang, and that's what they're doing. So much for saying either fighter is in trouble. Taking it and giving it here in round two. A good left hand. Man, I'm sure Lozano has to be saying, what's it going to take to drop this guy? But he is still throwing another good left. Chuck knee there from Lozano. Still, Weedman comes forward. And this has been a slugfest. I'm really surprised we're not seeing more leg kicks from Weedman trying to chop Lozano down. He seems to want a box. And he's eating some big right hands. Weedman missing with that jab. Under 90 seconds now remaining in round number two. This is what you and I thought it would be, a striking battle between Chris Lozano and Brent Weedman. And it's looked like a boxing match. Weedman, the superior Muay Thai fighter, we're not seeing a lot of kicks, not a lot of knees. Looks like a boxing match. Join us next Saturday night for Bellator 50 from the Seminole Hard Rock Hotel and Casino in Hollywood, Florida. We will have all four quarterfinal round fights of Bellator Season 5 Middleweight Tournament. You can see the prelim fights live on Spike.com and Bellator.com beginning at 5 p.m. Eastern. And note the special starting time for our television broadcast, 7 p.m. Eastern. Of course, you can see it right here live on MTV2 and NHD on Epics. They see that left hand. Another beautiful right, right up through the center. Now it's Lozano going back. Stiff left jab there by Weedman. I'm sick of saying Weedman's in trouble. He just keeps taking shots and moving forward. But Lozano is landing the heavier blows. I can't believe they are keeping this pace. Weedman now applying pressure. Lozano back against the Bellator cage fence. We've seen before, Weedman will resort to the takedown. Did a lot against Dan Hornbuckle. Was successful in the first round against Lozano on the ground. Might want to go there again. Lozano looking for a guillotine, never really cinched it on as Weedman tried to change levels. The end of round two. Great fight thus far, Jimmy. Outstanding fight to not go anywhere. This is amazing. This is just what we expected. You see here just a slugfest. Lozano accurate with that left hand, a knee, another one over the top. When Weedman, though, still coming forward in spite of all of this punishment. He was actually smiling going back to his corner for this round. But look at these shots by Chris Lozano. Man, this crowd's so into this fight. So am I, Sean. Are you ready? Back up, back up. Entering back up. our third and final round fight. of this fourth welterweight tournament quarterfinal. The last round, in fact, of this welterweight tournament quarterfinal round here in Bellator season five. Douglas Lima, Luis Santos, and Ben Saunders are through to the final four. The winner of this bout joins them. Then. Jimmy, on your scorecard. I have it all tied up, 19 apiece. Give Lozano the last round. Weedman the opening round. Chris Lozano is in the white trunks. Brent Weedman is in the gray trunks. Spin oh. back kick by Lozano. Weedman didn't even flinch. Another spinning back kick. Weedman ready for that. Snatches the single leg. Lozano throwing the right hand. Going for what we call an outside switch in wrestling. Great defense of that takedown. Even still holding the single leg. And Lozano cannot let himself get taken down. That's how he lost the first round. He's doing very well on the feet. He needs to stay on his feet against Weedman. Both fighters, so much respect for each other, both saying these guys, their opponents are so tough respectively, so tough respectively to finish. Well, they've proven that tonight. The shots Weedman took in that last round would drop a rhino, and he is still here, still fighting hard. Speaking of fighting, he got the takedown he was fighting for. But Lozano back up to his feet. Oh, good throw by Lozano. 
Lozano now bearing rights into the rib cage. Weeman trying to explode up. Going here for the Darce choke, it looks like. Lozano setting up the Darce. Can't see how tight it is from here. Loads of time still remaining in this fight. He let's it go. Just under three minutes now remaining in this third and final round. We've been trying to work from the bottom, but Lozano putting a lot of pressure on him. Three minutes to go. This is still anyone's fight. Uh, now he's in full mount. Hasn't quite got it. It's still half guard. Doesn't have that foot through yet. Weedman still holding half guard. If he can sit up and strike, he can do a lot of damage from here. Those sneaky right hands. But Lozano's so heavy handed. Right Doesn't need a lot now. of space to do damage. Big shots from Lozano. Weedman telling us, Jimmy, that he is in the best shape of his career by far. In fact, the best shape of his life. He needs to be for this fight. Man, look at those shots to the ribs. Lozano obviously in spectacular shape. Both fighters expending so much energy defensively and offensively in this uh, fight. Going for the Americano, but his arm is behind the head. Very hard to finish from here. I don't think he's going to get Brent Weedman with that. Lozano looking for the key lock finish. And said, so you see his left arm behind the head of Brent Weedman. That's not where you want your hand for the key lock. I think he should sit up and work his ground and pound just like he's doing. There's so much pressure in this fight. Both guys throwing everything they have. It's going to be who's got the gas for this last minute and a half. Lozano now trying to take the back. Lozano thinking rear naked choke. All right, I was thinking we call a cross face, trying to pull that head away from his leg. Oh, good job by Weedman. Good explosive drive forward by Brent Weedman. Back and forth we go. Weedman getting the waist cinch. Lozano trying to control the leg, turning in. Good jujitsu. Nice balance, good base. In Staying on top, only a minute left to go. And into that final minute. Weedman holding the open half guard. Lozano posturing up on both knees. He's got to get some distance to land that right hand. Right now they're trapped in this position. Only 35 seconds left. So far, I think Lozano has been on top more. Will that be the deciding factor? We'll have to see. Wide base by Lozano, taken down there by Weedman. Weedman getting the waist cinch. What can he do with it? Only 14 seconds left. Knee from Brent Weedman. Dragging Lozano down in the final seconds of this fight. The bell, the end of a tremendous fight. An outstanding fight. Very close in this third round. We'll have to see which way the judges go. When we return, we will learn the winner and the fourth and final semi-finalist. Chris Lozano versus Brent Weedman. A tremendous 15 minutes of fighting. Jimmy on your scorecard. I have it 29-28. Chris Lozano, I think he took the last two rounds. Here again is Michael Williams. Ladies and gentlemen, for the decision, we'll go to your judges' scorecards. All three judges, Ricardo Almeida, Romulo Bittencourt, and Cardo Urso, all score the fight exactly the same at 29 to 28. All for the winner by unanimous decision. And now the fourth semifinalist in the welterweight tournament, Chris, the Cleveland Assassin, Lozano. A hard-fought win for Chris Lozano, now 9-1 in his pro MMA career. Absolute elation for Chris Lozano. And in just a few moments, he will speak to Jimmy Smith inside the Bellator cage. Chris, I'm here with your winner, Chris Lozano. Chris, rarely do two fighters say they're going to stand up and bang and actually do it. What does it feel like to have that fight over with and be victorious? Man, Brett Weedman is one bad AM effort. Man, that was a war, baby. I was ready, though. Brent, thank you, man, for giving me that much better, man. Those are the fights that make champions. Well, Chris, 
You are moving on to an extremely stacked semifinal division. Are you ready for another fight against an opponent like this? I, I'm ready right now. We can do it tonight. I'll wait. Give me about, yeah, about 15 minutes, baby. I'm ready. Well, fortunately, you have a month to prepare. Thank you so much for an outstanding fight. Chris Lozano, ladies and gentlemen.